As you can see, Bob is setting down. And he has weights here. And he has this thing right here, which is transferring this weight over to the here. So it's putting pressure on the top of his leg so he can do calf raises while he's setting down. So Bob, now that you have your weight on there, demonstrate the exercise. Yes, sir. Now, Bob is probably going to do about 30 repetitions, which is the calf muscles are different than your other muscles, like your chest and your quads and stuff like that. You really have to work these with a lot of reps, especially if you want that look. And this is the exercise you're going to do if you're a bodybuilder. Because it only puts stress on the calf. And it actually, you know what? It probably, uh, probably gives you strong feet. <laughs> Now the other thing, look at my feet here, depending on the angle of your feet, that is going to work the calf in a different way, as you can see right here, which I won't want to lose my balance, but see how my calf's towards the outside, and then see how my calf's towards the inside, and then straight down the middle. So, depending on how you position your feet, that's going to determine what emphasis that, that's going to be put on the calf. So like, look, let's say you're, uh, let's say you're weak on the outside, turn your feet around and hit it. You got that? Do you guys get that? How many sets should they do? Do you guys get that? That's what you do. Sam, how many so. sets? I think, you know, for uh, an intermediate, uh, weightlifter, I would say five sets of 20 to 30 reps. If you're a competitor or an, uh, an elite weightlifter, calves are really tough. And depend depending on what you want, I really think 10 sets. 10 sets. Yeah, 10 sets. Now you can do 10 sets. You can do 10 sets of seated, or maybe 10 sets of standing calf raises, or whatever. But you got to, you know, you mix it up. But if you do 10 sets, 20 to 30 reps, you're gonna put some size on your calf. Um, I'm not saying that you won't put size on if you did five sets of 20 to 30, but if you want them to look uh, beautiful, you should crank them out, man. Crank out the reps. I mean, you get what you get what you put in it, and that's that's with all these exercises. If you don't uh, give it 110 percent, then you're you know you put in 110 percent, you're going to end up getting 50 percent. So you know, I know that don't make sense to you, but the harder you work, the more you get. So you want to bust your butt so you do get that 100% in there. So don't be lazy.